Thank you for being here. My name is Ayla Nova, and it is an honor to share the practice of Yoga Nedra with you. In this practice, you will be guided through your own unique experience of body-mind connection in the space between sleep and dreaming, allowing you to calm the nervous system so you can release stress and tension. By returning to the present moment, you will begin to release anxiety and the worries that cloud your waking day. Even if it is only for a moment, it is in these moments your body can begin to restore. Thich Nhat Hanh says, Be like the earth. When the rain comes, the earth simply opens up to the rain and soaks it all in. Through Yoga Nedra, you expand your awareness by connecting with the Sankalpa. Your Sankalpa is the seed and you the earth. May this practice bring the rain you need to witness how far you have come and how much you have grown. If you are unfamiliar, a Sankalpa is a positive, personal, concise, present tense I am declaration to self that resonates deeply. Allow your Sankalpa to be a heartfelt desire that you wish to water and manifest into your reality. You are invited to take a comfortable position lying on your back. You may wish to do so on a couch, recliner, or more traditionally on a yoga mat. If you are using the practice for the purpose of sleep, lying on your bed is another alternative. You may consider using a pillow, blankets, props, a bolster under your knees to maintain a comfortable position throughout the practice. As your nidra practice begins to deepen, you may notice these props will no longer serve you. Until then, please make yourself comfortable with all the support you need. Wherever you may choose to practice, please lay on your back with your spine in alignment your legs wide, allowing your hips to settle. Your arms rest naturally by your sides, allowing your shoulders to soften. And place your palms skyward or onto your heart or belly. Ensure your forehead is slightly above your chin, elongating and aligning the spine. Allow your awareness to move inward by closing your eyes. Shavasana. Give yourself time to settle into your sacred space. There will be moments of comfort and of discomfort. Welcome all sensations as a messenger, allowing these messages to move through you. Experience sensation without attachment. Have ease in knowing all which arises as the nature to pass away. Rather than immediately reacting, be responsive to your experience as this messenger may also be providing an opportunity to shift and change yourself if it will bring you more ease. During all states of consciousness, the benefits of Yoga Nidra will be received. The practice of remaining awake is your choice and strongly encouraged. 
Make the conscious choice now to remain rested, yet aware, for the practice of Yoga Nidra. You are supported by the earth beneath you, held by the space around you, and accepted just as you are and who you grow to be. And the practice of Yoga Nidra begins now. Become aware of the walls around you. All that surrounds you. Bring a sense of safety and comfort into yourself and the space you have created. This is your opportunity to connect to your truest self. And your truest nature. Every experience you encounter is a guide towards a deeper knowing of your own body, mind, and spirit. See if you can release a little more tension with every exhale. Observing the nature of your breath. Without manipulation, begin to notice how it steadily moves in and out of your nostrils. Notice the rise and the fall of your belly and chest. Observe your breathing. Tracing your inhale. Noticing where you deeply sense your inhale. And tracing your exhale. Noticing where you sense your exhale. Then release, let it go. Aware that you are breathing in. Aware you are breathing out. Have compassion for your breath. If it is shallow, allow it to be shallow. If it is deep, allow it to be deep. Know that at any moment, if you need to return to yourself, your breath is there for you, bringing you back to the present moment. Notice now How you have come to this exact moment. What heartfelt desire, wish, prayer are you calling to unfold into your reality through the practice of Yoga Nidra? Allow yourself the space to hear your inner telling, your intuition your intelligence your intelligence perhaps a limiting belief has surfaced your worthiness your wholeness your belonging perhaps an insight into your current health well-being capacity for love for understanding, for acceptance, maybe success. Be gentle and kind with yourself as what you have been experiencing. 
may have been rooted in fear, blocking you from receiving what it is you are here to call in. Allow yourself to observe the emotions, feelings, and sensations that arise. You are being called to rewrite your programming. Allow your heart to find the affirming words that frame your deepest desire, wish, prayer. Allow the sound of these words to vibrate into your whole being and land into the space of the mind's eye. If your sankalpa remains unclear, you may use one of the following until your truest sankalpa reveals itself, during your practice, or at a later time. I am resilient. I am worthy. I am whole. I am healthy. I am open to receiving. I trust. Or simply, I am. Surrender into the vastness within as you declare internally and eternally your sankalpa three times. With conviction, feel and sense yourself repeat it for every cell to hear your words acting as a vibration that you call within and extend out. I am. I am. I am. Allow the vibration of your Sankalpa to expand to all the edges of your body. And for those waves of vibration to eventually settle in complete stillness. Stillness that lands your attention to the edges of your body. And as you rest here, feel that you are as still as a glass of water. Sense your edges begin to melt into spaces of comfort, ease, and well-being. Surrender to your stillness. Allowing my voice to become your voice as you move through your awareness. Remain so still as to not disturb the water. You are pure sensation. And don't change anything. If you cannot sense these parts of yourself, imagine them. Imagine the sensations. Rest in full awareness as you begin to experience the rotation of consciousness, beginning at your right hand thumb. Right hand thumb. Right hand thumb. 
index finger, middle finger, ring finger, little finger. back of the hand, palm of the hand, whole right hand, right wrist, forearm, elbow, Awareness traveling up your arm to your shoulder. Whole right arm. Awareness traveling from your right shoulder across your collarbone. Down the right side of the chest. right side body right side of the abdomen right side of the pelvis right Aware of the upper leg, right knee, whole right knee, whole right knee, shin, ankle, the top of the foot. Right big toe. Second toe. Third toe. Fourth toe. Little toe. The sole of the foot. Right heel. Whole right foot. Whole right foot. Whole right foot. Calf. Back of the knee. Hamstring. Right glute. Right side of the lower back. Mid back. Upper back. Right shoulder. Right shoulder blade. Right shoulder, the back of the arm, the elbow, lower arm, back of the hand, all the fingers and thumb of the right hand. The whole right hand. The whole right foot. The whole right arm. The whole right leg. The whole 
right side of the torso. Awareness of the whole right side of your body. Aware of its density, the weight, and the texture, the energy of the whole right side, whole right side, whole right side. Awareness travels now towards the left hand thumb. Left hand thumb. Left hand thumb. Index finger. Middle finger. Ring finger. Little finger. On the back of the hand. On the palm of the hand. The whole left hand in awareness. Totally still. Left wrist. Forearm, elbow, upper arm, left shoulder, the whole left arm. Awareness traveling from the left shoulder across the collarbone. Left side of the chest. Left side body. Left side of the abdomen. Left side of the pelvis. Left hip. On the top of the left leg. Left knee. Left knee. Left knee. Shin. Ankle, top of the left foot, ankle, and the whole left leg, and top of the foot, left big toe. Second toe, third toe, fourth toe, little toe, all of your left toes, the sole of the foot. The heel of the left foot. The whole left foot. Calf. Hamstring. Left glute. Left side of the lower back. Mid back, upper back, and 
Awareness of the left shoulder blade. Remaining still as this awareness travels into the left shoulder. The upper arm. Left elbow. Forearm. The wrist. The whole left arm. The left hand. Back of the hand. All the fingers and thumb. Awareness of the left hand. Left foot. Left arm. Left leg. Whole left side of your torso. Aware of the whole left side of your body. The sensations. And density. Texture. Experience the whole left side of yourself. Now, begin to experience the right side of your body. And then the left. Again, the right. Travel this awareness of sensation back and forth. Eventually experiencing your whole self. The left and right side of the body. Awareness now traveling up the spine. Towards the base of the skull. Since the length of the neck. In the base of the skull. Awareness traveling forward towards your temples. Melting across your forehead. As you remain so still. Softening the eyebrows. Bring awareness to your eyelids. Awareness of your eyes within the orbs of your eye sockets. Both eyes in awareness. Aware of the nasal cavity. And traveling this awareness through the eardrums to the opening of the ears. Sensing the craters and curves of both ears. Awareness moves across the cheekbones towards the bridge of the nose. From the bridge of the nose to the tip of the nose. Sensation traveling around the nostrils. Aware of your upper lip. Aware of your lower lip. Aware of both lips. It's 
sensing the point of your chin. Awareness melts along the jawline, releasing tension as you remain so still. Notice a softness across the cheekbones. Awareness landing at the base of the ears. Travel the sensation along the sides of your neck. Around your shoulders. And across your collarbones. Awareness moving down your arms, sensing both arms simultaneously. As the awareness lands onto your hands, the palms of your hands, the back of your hands, both hands in awareness. Awareness expanding out your arms. From your hands, begin to experience now your whole torso. Across your chest, your rib cage, back body, belly, hips. Pubic bone. Tailbone. Your whole spine in awareness. Sensing how still and aligned you are in your awareness. Awareness traveling past your glutes, your upper leg your lower legs, both legs. Floating your awareness into your feet, from the soles of your feet to the tips of your toes. And from the tips of your toes to the tips of your fingers. From the tips of your fingers to the top of your head. Rest in full awareness. Observe yourself resting in this sacred space you have created. You are aware. Completely aware. Completely still and aware. With no effort. You are aware. Aware of your whole body at rest. Your whole being at rest. Your whole self at rest. Become aware of your breath. Pranamai kosha. Aware as you breathe in. Aware as you breathe out. Sense the rhythm of your breath in and out of your lungs. Do not try to change your breathing. Unless it will bring you more comfort. Let it be totally natural. You are not manipulating the breath. There should be no effort involved. 
only observe. Complete awareness of your breath. Connecting with your next inhale. Without manipulation of the breath, begin to say the word so. Inhale it into the mind's eye. Breath traveling inward. And connect with your exhale. Say the word hum internally. And continue to repeat this mantra so hum as the breath enters and the breath exits the body. Inhale so. Exhale hum. Inhale so. Exhale hum. So, hum. Continue to breathe with this mantra and you will be called back in a few moments. Exhale and release the mantra. Totally let go. There is no destination. You are practicing yoga nidra. Return to my voice. The emotional body is present here. Manamaya Kosha. You are an explorer of your present state, the fluid space of equanimity where you are in harmony with all opposing forces, a deep knowing that you are in a space where exploring opposing sensations is merely a part of the human experience. Remain in the seat of the witness and begin to move into the sensations of sadness. Draw into the subconscious void where a deep-rooted memory of sadness resides. If you do not discover one, that is okay. You can simply rest in the emotion of sadness. Experience all that arises from this space. If there is a memory, let this memory of sadness sit with you. Lean into the sadness. Notice where it lingers in the body. How it is sensed in the breath. Your whole being and plane of existence. Experience sadness. Sadness. Sadness.
Now release this memory. Release all these sensations that come with it. Allow for sadness to dissolve away from the body into the ground seeping away from the space around you. Let it go and return to this very moment in time where you are neutral and unaffected. Remaining in the seat of the witness, move into the sensation of joy. Draw in from the subconscious void a memory of absolute joy. True bliss. A moment in time that you sense the truest form of joy. Absolute joy. Hold this experience of joy in your awareness and sense how it feels in the whole body. Notice how it is sensed in the hands and the feet, on the face, in every pore, in every cell of yourself. Bring the experience of joy. 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 Now, experience sadness. And again, joy. Allowing your awareness to travel back and forth from sadness. And again, to joy. And now sadness and joy simultaneously. Sadness and joy as one whole experience. And begin to release the sensations. Release any attachment. Return to a neutral space within the room. Sense yourself release all the attachment and experience equanimity. Feel it emotionally, physically, energetically in your whole being. Vijana Mayakosha. Bringing your awareness to the clearing between your brows, the space of the mind's eye, connecting you to your limitless creativity, and connecting to your intuition. Soften the inner gaze as you begin to move through a rapid visualization. Release each image, sensation, experience as you move on to the next. Letting go as you focus purely on the presence of what arises in each moment. Aware of a pen writing in blue ink the colors of summer
a crystal ball showing the future. A warm blanket as you watch the waves come in. The smell of a bonfire. A hazy view of the mountains. The sound of a crowd cheering. A morning bird. A morning bird. A morning bird. Sand slipping through your fingers. A yogi chanting. Colorful ribbons floating through the sky. A lush garden. A child bouncing on a knee. Rain clouds on the horizon. Rain clouds on the horizon. Rain clouds on the horizon. And as you rest in full body awareness, Experience peace in your current form. Witnessing yourself standing in a serene meadow. Surrounded by lush greenery and vibrant flowers. The sky above is covered with heavy clouds. Promising of rain. Feel a gentle breeze, a whisper of anticipation on your skin. Sense the presence of the imminent rain, like the thoughts that sometimes gather in the corners of your mind. The rain begins to fall. Each raindrop is a tiny messenger of clarity, falling from above to cleanse and purify. Feel the rain touching your skin, cool and inviting. As the rain intensifies, it washes away accumulated dust and debris from life, just as it does for the earth. Observe the darkness of the clouds above, like the challenges and uncertainties that sometimes obscure your inner light. But remember, within every cloud there is the potential for transformation. Just as rain revitalizes the earth, let this rain cleanse your mind and your body, clearing away all that no longer serves you. Imagine the raindrops merging with your being, dissolving any lingering tension, worries, 
or negative thoughts. With each drop, feel as though it carries away all the fragments of stress, leaving you lighter and more at peace. as you let the rain continue its dance. Visualize tears mixing with the rain, symbolizing the acceptance of all emotions, including sadness. Embrace the vulnerability that accompanies these tears. Understanding that they too have a cleansing power. Like rain, tears nurture the soil of your soul. It is not meant that you must cry, but that you acknowledge that it is okay for you to feel sadness. Just as your spirit is being nourished by this practice, feel the ground beneath you become nourished and fertile. Witness the flowers around you, and their petals stretching towards the sky, embodying the resilience that blooms in the face of adversity. As you release and cleanse, remember your own innate strength and capacity for growth. With the rain's gentle persistence, a sense of gratitude awakens within you. And gratitude for the challenges that have shaped you. For the tears that have cleansed you. And for the resiliency that you have carried through. Acknowledge that growth requires both rain and sunlight. Challenges and triumphs. As the rain begins to subside, sense that the clouds part to reveal a sky painted with hues of gold and pink, symbolizing the dawn of new beginnings. Allow yourself to rest to this new beginning. Feeling the earth beneath you and the revitalizing energy coursing through your veins. With each inhale, draw in the essence of renewal. With each exhale, Releasing gratitude into the world. And with this sense of gratitude and renewal, invite your Sankalpa to grow, bringing it back into your awareness. Shining this awareness onto the mind's eye. Repeat your Sankalpa now three times. Repeat it with conviction, declaring it into the corners, the shadows, the darkness within. 
shining light on where you must grow. I am, whatever it may be, I am, declare it loud and true, I am. And rest into the awareness of your Sankalpa. Returning now to your whole self. Come back to the body and the surface you rest on. Aware of your form, your skin, how air rests on it, your face, how peace is placed on it, your heart, how it beats life and love and acceptance. You are loved, just as you are and who you grow to be. Hiriyom Tat Sat Hiriyom Tat Sat Hiriyom Tat Sat Let your first movements back into the room be gentle. If you wish to sleep, you may drift off to sleep. Otherwise, begin to flutter the fingers, the toes. Rotate the ankles, the wrists. Trust your intuition. And when you're ready, Slowly guide yourself onto your side, hugging your knees tightly into your chest. And in your own time, move into a seated position where you may consider meditation, reflection, or journaling as a way to close your experience. Thank you for being here. I always love responding to your comments on YouTube and Instagram. Together we grow. And by following, subscribing, or sharing Yoga Nedra and Beyond, you help me extend these free practices even further. I'm sending a special thank you to those who have offered the gift of gratitude as it has and will continue to water this work. Remember, the key to your growth lies within, waiting to be nourished and nurtured. Rest well, be well. Namaskar.